Asian doll is talking about something. I look better than both you bees. BF and for real. Last time I checked, all three of these girls got surgery. Seriously? Let's talk about it. I know y'all want to get to the tea, and baby, we will. But for those of y'all that's been living under a rock, baby, my name is Scott Santana. I've only been on YouTube since I was 2016. Started off going viral, telling stories about my crazy life. A couple of years later, I started doing ratchet recipes, went viral on TikTok. Then I opened up a channel, a lot of souls, where I was, you know, using my spiritual and psychic gifts to help the girls and whip them back into alignment. In other words, baby, she's gifted. And see, now I'm here to share all of those gifts on one channel. Beside me, whether it's a deep dive, a commentary video, cooking music, Reading Harvest Soaps. Baby, if I want to upload a video of me picking my nose and breathing for 60 minutes, I'm into it. My house, my rules. I mean, I just ask that y'all follow me over on Twitter so I can stop talking to myself. And before you go and try to seek help and seek therapy, baby, seek me. Go to my website and book yourself a personal reading if you need one. Now, feel free to sound off in the comments, but be respectful and act like you got that act right. Now, this channel is for critical thinkers. We may not always agree. You may not always even like me. But one thing's for sure, your life will be changed after experiencing me. So subscribe. Now, enough of me rambling, child. I think we made it past the part that was needed to get this video monitored. Let's get into it. I want people to have fun. Let's kick back. Let's get into a little tea. Let's not get too crazy, but let's enjoy the sip. But let's get to the chi chi, the kiki, the the internet bull. What is going on, y'all? It's Scott Santana, <laughs> who does not have the banner on screen. Okay, listen. <clears throat> Let's start that over. It's who? It's Scott Santana, aka Ch 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 Chi Chi. And we are back from the Baddies Caribbean update video. Ciao. Now, y'all know Asian Doll and Stunner been fighting down to the Twitter, girl. Fighting down to the Twitter. Don't ask me how it started. Don't ask me why they fighting, Chad. I don't know. That's why we're here, so we can figure out together, because why Stunner Girl is still beefing with anything Zeus is beyond me. Stunner Girl, you are on a completely new network. Let it go and move on, baby. Let it go and move on. I've seen the mansion that you now live in. You got too many rooms in that house to be focused on anything going on over there at Zeus. <sighs> And if Asian doll thinks she about to bring herself over to Zeus and then now get into all of these rap beefs with all of these other female rappers and then they somehow all end up on Zeus just for the purpose of hoping to see both of them on the episode so they can fight. No, we're we not about to do this. We're not about to do this. This is why I did not want to see Asian doll on baddies because I feel like it's going to open the door for the cash dolls, for the Cuban savages, for the Rico nasties, for filling the blank with all of these other rappers who have yet to make it, who've yet to get a even a, a good look from Cardi B or Nicki Minaj. Like, <sighs> come on now. Come on now. Come on now. If they couldn't make it in their career, what makes y'all think they're going to make it in TV? Come on now. And that might be a little, that might be a little harsh. But I mean, listen, it's my channel. I'm saying what I want to say. I don't want to see it. I don't want to see it. But y'all know we already got to get into it. So go ahead and like this video. These bitches is washed. I am the soap in these rags ain't involved. Been saying shit since I didn't mama for rocks. They hate to see that a bitch following your top. Stop. Keep watching my social media. Changing my Wikipedia. These trendy to the top and tedious. I will stop from sitting up. Who got the, who got the trench? Who got the, who got the wrench? Who got the, who got the weed? And they all going up for me. I'm trying to party. Let's get naughty. Twerk your body. Work this party. I'm trying to party. Let's get naughty. Twerk your body. Work this party. Okay, so let me go ahead and put it on screen. Because <clears throat> I'm thinking that this is where it all started. But y'all know I like to try to be as thorough as possible. So I'm going back to, I'm going back to, uh, I'm 
Okay, let me show y'all what I'm looking at. Let me show let me show y'all what I'm looking at. Because especially if you just watch the video that I did with Meatball, you can tell it while I'm why I'm annoyed. Because look what's going on. This same thing was done with the whole JT video. When it was JT and Carisha fighting. It's like these like why do they post and delete as though people are not gonna screen grab it? I hate it. I hate it so bad. I hate it. I hate it so bad. So now we got to rely on hoping that people got all the right screen caps. But I'm going to just assume that this is where it started. Because I don't know, because Asian was clearly deleting her tweets. Like, girl, did you not just come off of baddies? If you're a true baddie, then stand in your bad shit. Why are we deleting tweets? But Asian had tweeted out, just made 200000 for appearance on TV. Bitch, I'm blessed. I don't even think she worth that much. I'm sorry, Zeus is never escaping the allegations that they really over there just cleaning drug money because the way that they literally just be throwing out like charity donations to people, like what has Asian done in her whole entire career to even show that she's worth $200,000? Has she even made $200,000 in her career off her music? Y'all better get these girls $200 and keep it pushing. And she's supposed to be coming in along with Blueface sister and Meatball as the celebrity guest. So does that mean that Meatball got $250,000? Like, what, what have they done? And mind you, I'm not hating. I mean, do what you do, but at the same time, it has to make sense. It has to make sense. Because at least the IRS going to be asking, like, oh, so y'all giving it up like that? Because what has an Asian doll done to make that $200,000? I guess. I guess. I guess shout. It's giving clean and drug money. I don't watch enough power, but that's what she had tweeted. So I don't know if this is where it started, but apparently after she had posted this, then we had um Stunner Girl coming out with a tweet. Now, like I said, the the T page that I'm getting this information from could very well not have posted everything and just pick and choose screenshots. I don't know, but since Asian was deleting her tweets, this is all we can go off of. So Stunner ends up saying, I could book you for 10K. You broke bum A, B. You're too easy to get. So come to LA and get beat on. LMAO, save me the work, P-U-S-S-Y. Hold on. I got, I, I'm sorry. I'm going to have to go through. See, this is why I need all the tweets. Because if Stunner just said this unprovoked, then that's wild. But if she was responding to something, then that, like, that's needed to know for context clues. So I'm um, bear with me as I'm scrolling through her. Oh my God. And Stunner is going in. Stunner is going in on her Twitter. Oh my God. How we going? Okay, how we gonna do this? How we gonna do this? Because there's way too many tweets to count. Um, and it looks like Stunner wasn't even responding to Asia necessarily. She wasn't tagging her, is what I mean. So let me go to Asian Dolls page and see if these there's any receipts left. <laughs> Um, all these Asian doll fan pages, like what's her actual page? Okay, I found it. Okay, so somebody randomly tweeted, being mad at another black woman because she gets into the bag is actually insane. Who raised these girls for real? Pocket watching is already crazy, but being mad at someone because they got a better contract is crazy. Be mad at the executive team and go to the boardroom with that animosity. Oh, an Asian doll reposted this, right? So I guess maybe Stunner Girl did come at her, I guess. Because somebody else says they started with Asian knowing that she's going to take it to hell every single time. So leave her alone and y'all won't have to worry about her going to places that y'all don't want her to go on the internet.
Um, this is a lot. This is a lot, y'all. This is this is. Okay, um, we just gonna have to take it one page at a time because it looks like they were not tagging each other, and it's uh, it's a lot of subliminals on both sides. So we just gonna take it one page at a time. Let's start with um, we're gonna start with uh, Stunner Girls page after this. So Asia ended up responding to this page that y'all see on screen saying, "We'll give you a hundred k to fight me on Zeus, and you know for sure they will let us fight. No breaking up until somebody get and beat the fuck up badly. If you turn that down, you for sure puss." <sighs> I mean, I kind of agree because Stunner, you seem to pop off at any other moment. You seem to pop off and bring all your niggas and bring the whole hood out at any other moment. So it ain't like this is above you. Somebody says this isn't fair. Stunner Girl already caught Asian out, but Asian only wants to fight with Zeus and Vaughn. And she knows Stunner Girl don't fuck with them. Okay, so why is she bringing them up every... No, miss me with that comment. I think Asian is a better fighter than Stunner. I would agree. I would agree. Um, Stunner not whooping Asian... I don't care what y'all say. Her hand's not top tier. Funny how she be become the victim because she started all of this. Oh. So, Asian said, Zeus just said they never paid a cast member 500k in life, especially not Novich that needed their platform and that stood in line to get picked with a big-ass number stuck to their chest at auditions. Bees who don't even fight hard enough for Zeus to give them anything over 60k. Stop the chatting. Somebody says they paid Tommy that. Asian says, girl, no, they did not. You do not know ish with the F. I want Tommy to come into the chat and go off. Because we also got to remember, Stunner Girl and Tommy was on Baddies West. They was not getting to the bag like that then. I mean, they was, but they wasn't like how they are now. So they wasn't giving out big numbers like that. Like, do we not remember them all fighting over who's? Which one of y'all bald-headed bitches in my DMs on Instagram? Hold up. Like, do y'all not remember watching Baddies West where they was all complaining about having to split eleven hundred dollars? Y'all don't remember that? Y'all don't remember that? Oh, shout out to you. Okay. Um, let's keep going. Yeah, I'm going to need these baddies pages to get it together. Get it together. Y'all posting half the tea. Okay, so let's just go ahead and take it on over to Stunner Girls page because... Wait, unless, 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 unless... Let's try TikTok real quick. Hey, guys, I am going uh, on... They be clocking it. Hey, guys, I am going... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Wait, we might have to do an update. Oh, now my bitch got a new look. Shout out to you. Look, did y'all watch this video? The video that I did on this? If you didn't, please go watch it. Because it was hilarious. It was hilarious. If y'all know what this is, let me go to my page and see if I can find a video for y'all. Y'all need to watch it. It was absolutely hilarious. This video right here. The girl got exposed to catfishing man on black dating app. Please go watch this video because it was absolutely hilarious. Hilarious. I'm going to have to do an update. Not how going on a new date with a new look. It's been about an hour. Ooh. Yeah, go on. Hey, guys. I am going. Um, anyways, let's see. Asian doll. What's the other girl name? Stunner. Stunner girl. <sighs> okay. Can we get all the information? This is a lot. Now we got live streams to go into, too. See, this is how I end up be sitting here talking for an hour. Slot of game, pussy. You know I brought my knife to him. Shut that up. So y'all stunner and Asian doll of beef. Asian says instead of fighting, you set a bitch up and had ends jump her and put her in a cage. B, you been ussy. 
Stunner says you've been talking about it ever since it happened. You fan a obsessed beach, but you talk indirect like the scary hoe you is and stop giving niggas credit. You don't know what really went down. Okay. These bitches, they be confused. They don't know if they don't like hoes or if they want to be a hoe. Bitches speak down on prostitutes and then they be in porn stars on OnlyFans. So it's like a lot of these hoes in the game be super confused. Like these bitches be sitting back and they be watching a bitch and they be feeling like they better than the bitch and they got all their shit to say. And in reality, they secretly want to do everything a bitch is doing. Like you hoes want to sell pussy. Y'all just don't know how to sell it. So y'all give it up for free. And y'all, these bitches, they be confused. They don't know. I want to like, go set her board ass down. You making too much money to sit here on Instagram with all of these imaginary, imaginary threats. Ooh, not AAA. Come on, spirit. Everybody say, hey, spirit. And 3663, hey, spirit. But I can't stand those of y'all that be on Instagram and be subbing imaginary people in the captions and tweets. Like, everybody got all these imaginary haters and imaginary people that's trying to hold them back. Girl, ain't nobody holding you back but the devil in yourself. And I feel like y'all really fuck with me because I embody this California culture. Like, you know what I'm saying? I don't take no shit. Bitches can't run all over me. I'm sending demos all hoes. I rap about that shit. I'm in all the rooms and places these hoes wish they fucking are in. I got a real story. I don't hide my truth. I don't act like I'm better than people. I keep it too motherfucking. Let me pause. I'm tired of this. I'm so tired of this. I'm so tired of this. I'm so tired of this. I understood at one time we love Stunner because of everything that she's saying. But I'm just tired of everybody with this. Like, it's 2024. Can we come up with something else? I'm so tired of I'm so bad. I don't take shit from nobody. I get it on my own. I get it out the mud. I'm a single black independent mother that don't need no man. I, I'm strong and I'm I'm fierce. For, like all, I'm tired of all of it. I'm tired of all of it because it's all stemming from a place of trauma. Like how about you just you just lit because you're just that bitch, and you're that bitch because you're just naturally gifted and talented like let the art speak for itself i'm tired of the backstories i don't care what the backstory is i'm tired i'm tired i'm tired i'm tired because everybody has a backstory and they speak on their backstory every chance that they get to try and pull on some heartstrings and make a new fan i don't give a fuck what you've gone through everybody has gone through something everybody Everybody's going through something and everybody's going through something but i'm tired of this oh let's relate because of trauma I don't want to relate because we got bitches that envy us and hate us. I don't want to relate because, you know, we come from California and we 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 know, you know, the bloods and the crips and, and how it is on the South Side. Like, shut all that shit up. Let's relate because of the art. Change the frequency. I'm fucking tired. Please change the frequency. I'm so tired of negativity being the driving force. Let's make positivity the driving force. No, I'm that bitch because I want to see myself succeed. I'm that bitch because I like how it feels having money in my pocket. I'm that bitch because I like coming home to a fridge full of groceries. I'm that bitch because I like I like to shop and I like to spend money on shit and I'm expensive. I, I'm that bitch because I like to eat steak and lobster. You Do you understand what I'm saying? It's a way different frequency than I'm that bitch because, you know, bitches hated on me and I had to get it out the mud and I was the most prettiest, but they picked on me because I was light skin and I had beautiful hair. And they, shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. One day y'all going to wake up. At, y'all, one day people going to wake up to everything that I keep trying to tell people. Like, you don't understand how it literally affects you indirectly. Because it keeps you at a low vibrational frequency. And it's the same exact thing as constantly looking in the mirror and saying, oh, I'm going to always be broke. Oh, I'm going to always be ugly. Oh, I'm going to never find love. Oh, I'm going to always be treated like shit. Oh, I'm going to always be the black sheep. It's the same exact thing. It's the same exact thing. Because you're repeating constantly moments of trauma that you are convincing yourself is worth some sort of badge of honor. And it's all an illusion. It's all imaginary. It's all imaginary. As black people, we wear our trauma on our shoulders for some imaginary badge of honor that does not even exist and that people don't really care about.
Like I'm 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 t- I'm tired of this. I'm tired of this. So I'm also getting tired of Stunner. And I keep it so real that like if a bitch talking shit about me, they saying everything that I didn't already said about myself. It ain't nothing for me to hide. I'm open. So why are we still talking about it, Stunner? At the end of the day, why, I... Then why are we still talking about it? Because every time we do a Stunner video, you say the same thing. Why? Okay, so if a bitch is saying what you already done said about yourself and you feel like you don't need to clear it up, then why do we clear it up every two to six business weeks? That's what I'm talking about. Like you got all of this money. You got a song feature with JT. You was on a hit network. You out in LA living a dream. Taking trips whenever you want to. You got a man by your side that's riding for you. What is there to still be angry about? I don't, I, like, and it's not just stunning. It's all of these people. I don't even get it when Cardi get online. Oh, but they're just human. Okay, but they're also human enough to have enough money in their bank account to where if Twitter and social media is really fucking them up like that, then they could easily go pay for a social media assistant and get the fuck off and let somebody else handle it so that way they ain't never got to see the bullshit. You can easily put your phone down and go pay somebody since you have the money. I will never understand a depressed millionaire. I don't. I, I don't get it. I, do, I don't get it. It's not the same as somebody that's struggling, don't know where their next meal coming from, don't know how their bills going to get paid, whether or not they're going to be homeless or not. Like it, 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 it hits different when you're depressed, but you have money in your bank account because you can get the fuck up off your lazy ass and go do something. You can go invest in a therapist. You can go invest in a astrologer, a life worker, um, a light worker, rather, a therapist. Like you, you, can, you can go sit on somebody's couch and talk about it. And at the very least, you could go get you a bowl of crab legs, get you a seafood boil. Have your nice little spa day. But all of this feeling like, oh, I'm making millions of dollars, but I just got to address every last person that comes for me every time they come for me. You're miserable and you're bitter. There's nothing else to say. You're miserable and you're bitter. And it's not just Stunner. It's anybody who does that. Any and every one of them who does that, including Nikki, who I y'all know I love. Y'all know I love and stand Nikki and Cardi. But like, well, no, 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 no. Nikki's a little bit different. Nikki's a little bit different. Because it literally does affect her actual career, whether she says shit or she doesn't, it literally affects her career. Um, that's a little bit different, but y'all understand my point. Stand on big business, so it's like it really don't matter. These bitches, they be confused. They don't know if they don't like hoes or if they want to be a hoe. These bitches be sitting back and they be watching a bitch and they be feeling like they better than the bitch and they got all their shit to say. And in reality, they secretly want to do everything a bitch is doing. Like, you hoes want to sell Y'all just don't know how to sell it. So y'all give it up for free. And y'all start slow by selling it on OnlyFans. Y'all trying to get y'all feet wet. But in reality, you bitches is free lostitutes. And I feel like y'all really fuck with me because I embody this. Girl, anyways, anyways. I call only time I ever said something about a black bitch, I call Asian doll a bitter black bitch. And that's because I'm like, that bitch, she she every post the bitch was making was about her skin and she bitter about it. Like so she bitter. And I said it's two kinds of black bitches. There's a black bitch like me that loves the skin I'm in. And there's ones like her that really like don't don't like the skin they in. I call only time I ever said something about a black and I know some of y'all probably going to automatically jump to the whole colorism thing, but I think she's actually calling out the colorism thing. Now, I don't know what this is right here. This tag, that's racist as fuck. But yes, hey, uh, Asian Doll has hella tweets calling out dark-skinned girls. Calling out dark-skinned girls. And we'll get to that in a second. Um... I'm not even about to read. I'm not about to read that. I'm not about to read that. Um, let's see. Where's that tweet at? Right here. Asian Doll had posted back um, in 2013. And she said, see, it's a difference between brown skin and dark skin. Brown skin girls pretty. Don't nobody want no African ass dark skin bitch. Mind you, this is a girl that has <laughs> random drawings that's supposed to be, I guess, some sort of Chinese writing in her title, and her name is Asian Adol. I'm not one of those that dig up old tweets because 
I've been on Twitter since its inception. And so back then, a lot of us was wilding. From 07 to 2013, we was tweeting whatever because everything that we was told in school was, oh, social media going to follow you and da 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 And so a lot of us did not care and we purposely rebelled until, you know, after a certain point in time, we started seeing people get canceled. And then it was like, okay, let's stop fucking around. Let's stop playing around, whatever. So, I mean, I don't know how to feel about this. I don't know if she truly felt this way. I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't know. That's for y'all, not for me. I just don't like her because I don't like her. But um, a tweet from 11 years ago, I mean, y'all be picking and choosing what y'all accept from people. Because it could be it could be gay tweets that come up, like tweets bashing, you know, gay people and homophobia and all of this, that, and a third. And then y'all will overlook it, just like y'all did for the city girls. Now look at JT dating a whole fa- mm. <clears throat> Let's move on. So we're just going to read her page and then we're going to go and read Asian's page. Before we get into this, go ahead and like the video. If I'm for the trick, you won't have a list of you. I swear I'm at that. Okay, so let's go ahead and get into it. Um, when did this start? So this started, I guess, on April 15th. Or did it start on the 13th? Or did it start on a lot? I don't know when this started, y'all. I don't. I don't. I don't. We we just going to go through this together. <sighs> On April 7th, Sonny says, I love being me. I love how I pull for my life and don't sound like a motherfucking soul. I'm the originator of the source. Then on April 11th, Stunner says, I went on TV, then all the rap bees who've been hating on me followed in my footsteps. When you're an icon, it's part of the game first. They laugh at you, then they copy. I'm already on my next wave, and by that time, by the time they figure it out, I'm already too far gone. Pay and put up. Now, mind you, Stunner was on Baddies West. So, who came on Baddies East that was a rapper? Mariah Lynn? I think Mariah Lynn was the only rapper, right, on, on Baddies East. And then Baddie's Caribbean, Asian Doll, and Bianca. So, I mean, there's only but three people she could be talking about. Asian Doll, Bianca, or Mariah Lynn. Hmm. So, somebody says the Asian Doll shade, wake it up. Somebody says cosplay at its finest and stunner we trust. One day we could do a conversation about this because honestly and truly, all of this did not start until like 2015. Because black women especially were scared to do anything outside of a 27 honey blonde or a cherry red, if not a jet black. And we're talking rinse, not dye. Black women were not bleaching their hair and and doing all of these wild colors and this, that, and the third. No, not until like past like maybe 2015 is when it started. Miss me, miss me with the whole, oh, I could have been, you know, I was in school and I was an emo girl. And did Obviously, I'm not talking to you then, baby. Okay, I'm not talking to you. When I started YouTube, I started off as a natural hair guru. Okay, so I know my shit. I've, all, I've always been in the hair. And even when I was in high school back in like 07, I was bleaching my hair down. And it was just a thing that black people looked down upon. Black people did not really mess with bleaching their hair or coloring their hair and anything like that. And if they did color their hair, it was a rinse specifically. And it was always either black, honey blonde, or cherry red. But we wasn't doing all of those experimental colors. You know what I'm saying? And I know that for a fact because I used to get looked at like I was weird and then the same people that was looking at me like I was weird was coming around asking me to do their hair and whatnot like 
hell, I even showed up to my vocal concert with this type of hair. And it was by accident because, you know, through trial and error, I had bleached my hair, then tried to cut it off at a concert and then ended up looking like Tony the Tiger. Shout out to the people that remember that story time. But I'm just saying all of that to say, it's just it's just funny where we at now. People talking about copying and this, that, and the third when like our community wasn't even checking for shit like this 10 years ago. Like all of this is, is outdone to me because this is shit I was doing 20 years ago. Honestly. But I guess, I guess Natalie's copying off Stunner, I guess. Anyways, um, my career more successful than both bitches combined together and they was rapping before me. <sighs> Stunner, you bored. Please go take your board as somewhere and go do something. Go grocery shop, girl. Go learn a new, uh, a new, a new language. Like, please do something other than tweet to imaginary haters. Okay, this is her in concert. She looks so good. Oh my gosh, she looks so damn good. She look pretty as fuck. That hair, that's my favorite type of hair. Y'all know I love me a big curly unit. Oh, love me some big curly hair. She looks really good. She look real good. But like I said, I'm so turned off because I'm I'm so tired of people using the struggle and the trauma as a way of, of being relatable. I'm I'm over it. Change the frequency. Here they go, white girls fighting at the club. Now I'm not gonna say the clubs is packed out because Stunner is there. Cause that's what everybody's trying to do with JT. No, we won't know what JT's actually doing until she starts trying to do arenas. Clubs are always going to be packed out because it's a damn Friday. People want to party. And it's just an extra cherry on top that, oh my God, Sunny Girl's going to be there. Oh my God, JT's going to go, you know, going to be there. Stunner says, bitch, you can't speak on prostitutes. You've been rapping for 20 years and it didn't work out. So now you're doing porn on OnlyFans, selling that kitty, that shh, diaper, booty, and skinny lace combo. How you can't up a ticket right now. You're broke. You post fake money and get fake deals and your jury's fake. You're my daughter. You follow everything I do. You watch me real hard. I ain't never got whooped, not once. Bees got to jump me and they still lose. That's why you're scary. Wanted to talk it out. You must move. You must see moon goose face. Mm. And then you got everybody being messy tagging Asian doll. Okay. Um, stop lying to my mom because your mom is cracked out living in the same crack house she kicked you out of because you was a fast little girl effing on your mom's man. You're a tag along with no motion. When it's all over, you're going to be right back at home and nobody checking for you except that imaginary label you signed to. You done been passed around the whole industry. Any young dealer celeb can F you as long as they do drill music and got a chain. Honestly and truly, y'all both in the same situation, Stunner. It's just that you making more money. Because neither one of y'all is on the radio. Neither one of y'all are at the Grammys. Neither one of y'all are like getting all of these awards or on Billboard. Like, let's really talk about it. Let's really talk about it. You might have a little bit more clout right now, Stunner, because Asian Doll been out, what, 10, 15 years and, like, still ain't get it popping, still ain't get it lit, and you, like, kind of, like, in your prime right now, but y'all still at the same level. She says, you bees be sick. Y'all can't say y'all look better or have more money or more motion than me, so y'all lie on my mama. I never seen so many bees wishing a little girl was sex traffic or even making fun of a minor being sex traffic. <sighs> Asian Brat was quoting Stunner's lyrics back in July. Stunner says, you sell P to every young drill rapper in New York. Oh, child. She running around the streets of New York? She live up here? Girl. 
Chow, you sell pussy to every young drill rapper in New York. You fucking cougar. I know them New York girlies are sick of you popping through their projects, giving top to any man with diamond grill and microphone. You claim whatever men, you hood, you effing at the time, but you want to be from New York so bad, but you started rapping and sounding like them big Donkey Kong. What are they even talking about? Queen of drill, more like the queen of still. <laughs> That was cute. This is fact. She came to New York talking about Queen of Drill. Everybody wanted her out so bad. She did the same in Chicago. What's this? Bees don't got PJ money. I wasn't in those stripper hills, you lying. A, B, didn't one man touch me and he was laughing, telling me to chill out on you and Vaughn was best friends with my brother from New York. He immediately called after and said you were scary for walking off and let me push your head and he ain't had nothing to do with that and gave us your number. They don't F with you. Don't know and F with you. You want a man's love so bad and you get treated every time. Asian, I want to be New Yorker. She effed Dougie B. Like, that's a bad kill, son. And she effed mad other rappers from NYC. F that B. She dead. He... <sighs> right. I'm with this comment right here. Let's wrap this Twitter stuff up. It's time to link and fight. Like, at this point. At this point, Stunner, what are you waiting on? What are you waiting on, Stunner? Why they keep saying Stunner Girl can't have kids? This is so cap. These bees got to make up ish because they can't say nothing about me for real. Whole time she got the deletus fetus. Oh, not deletus fetus. Wow. Wow. She got the deletus fetus and her man had to go get another one pregnant. Oh my God. Not deletus fetus. Oh. <laughs> oh, that was a read. <laughs> B, you can't see me on no street-ish. How you claim to be so gangster, but you ain't known for no skits? Where have you ever... Huh? How you claim to be a gangster, but you're not known for no skits? So she's supposed to be, like, reciting lines and shit? Like, she's supposed to be funny? Was she a weigh-ins now? Like, I'm, I'm confused. Tiffany Haddish up in this bitch? Who knew it was giving Asian, Asian the Haddish? <laughs> What have you ever done besides argue on Twitter? Stunner, what have you done besides argue on Twitter? Oh, my God. Pot calling. Pot calling. You borrow your man gun and told it in your videos, but you ain't never pop nothing. You a wannabe Texas crip, LOL, a boy Frenchie in a wig. You're gang less and name less. I'm tired. I know Stunner Girl got to be tired. How do you live like this? I figured it out. This is why I don't like her. I don't like hood projetic just messes. Mind you, every like every a good majority of my exes are from the hood. So I'm not talking about hood people in general. That's not what I mean. But y'all know what I'm talking about. Like, y'all know exactly what I'm talking about. Heck, Chi Chi is ratchet. You know what I'm saying? So I'm don't don't. If I didn't say it, then it wasn't said. Okay. If I if I didn't say it, then it wasn't said. Don't go putting words in my mouth. But I hate people. I hate ignorant hood folk. And I feel like that's the energy that Asian gives off, which is probably why I keep saying I don't like her. Because even watching her talk right here in this video, I, I'm I, like, I know her type. I know her type. I know her type. Just ignorant, male identified, hood bitch that. Oh, that's my brother. That's my brother. Whole time they effing. Probably F on your, your, your best friend's man. Probably pick with a nigga intentionally just so she could call her boyfriend to come be him. Like, just. Mm. Y'all understand what I'm saying. Y'all understand what I'm saying? Like, it's okay to be ratchet, but like, it, it's the ignorant hood motherfuckers that I don't like. And that's the vibe she gives me. 
That's the vibe. Like, like very much like I'm on the bus and I'm on the train and I got a loud ass speaker as though everybody want to hear that. Very much the I order Chinese food delivery and the, and the driver scared to come to my door because he know that if he come up to the door, we're going to rob him. Very much that type of ignorant energy. Oh, you friend, can't say nigga, words. You told you me. I put the door. They thought, nigga, on my you life. Can't this say, you can't say you words. Like that. You keep putting everything on the door. You're going to get 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 Girl, I'm exhausted. At least she pretty though. She real pretty. She real pretty. But all that, all that hush, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. Let me know when you touch down in LA ho, or do I gotta bring you to me? Oh, you're not a street bitch. You just for the streets, bitch. All them rappers you after you didn't even get a feature out of it to help your career. <sighs> Men got a nut and you got left with your panties so you up. You need to get up under some good game, get real guidance and get some good instructions because you out here lost, giving up that little lobster tail. No. <laughs> not lobster tail. You out here giving up that lobster tail for free. You shouldn't speak on prostitutes when you're head of the lobstitutes. Oh. You're not a street bitch. You're just for the streets, bitch. Ooh. Can y'all please stop going back and forth and at least go slower? I'm trying to catch up and y'all honestly making it so hard for us. People that want to catch up on the argument. Every time I think I'm almost done reading it's something new. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> exactly b don't know don't want to fight me in real life scary want to do it for tv lol i'll book you and make you fight since you run in that mouth we're gonna say <sighs> you're gonna keep trying to hold on to memories of your high school virginity b yo p is a cemetery miss plan b you done killed about five kids b let it go you don't f the whole team in the national league and they business partners all for free you keep speaking down on hoes but you currently doing sex work on only fans you're a whole porn star for 5.99 you've been wanting to sell p you just didn't know how to so you gave it for the free <sighs> i could book you for 10k you broke bump see and this is what i'm talking about this this shit i'm talking about right here because was this not the first tweet that we read I'm gonna need these blogs to get it together. How y'all how y'all gonna be T blogs and then y'all y'all getting T from two days in, then missed a hundred thousand tweets that they done tweeted. Girl. So I really don't know who started what, but they both need to shut up, honestly. Right, this whole so confused and lost in the sauce. She believes her own delusional lies. I'm confused on how she's calling anybody a hoe when she in a new relationship every three to five business days and don't leave with nothing but a wet ass. Ooh, not leaving with nothing but a wet ass. No money, no hit songs, no record deals, just a one out pussy. I'd rather be a paid hoe. <sighs> Stunner says, "Bitch, you done touched on your siblings and f your mom." Oh. My Asian doll fucking hun. Mm. So Asian doll has molested her siblings and fucked her mother's nigga. And at that label ain't wait, and that label ain't dropped me, B. I'm not you. The F I was only signed for one tape and made a million, and they funded my independent label. I have my own label to this day. All my music drops under me, and you don't own none of your masters. No label ever wanted you, so you had to sign to a rapper. Then he dropped you. You just faked a singing. Recently, you used prop money. LOL, and that lady got paid to say that, and it didn't work. Oh, fake the signing. Child, I was about to say, uh, Millie Vanilli? What you mean she faked the singing? People still doing that? We doing Millie Vanilli now, Asia? Child, I would be in jail right now or fighting a case if I hit a kid. Stop capping. Bees was mad. I took their change, so they try to ruin my career. Mm. You've been talking, but ever since it happened, you fan ass upset, but you talk indirect like the scary how you with. So here's my thing: like the stunner just have her page pulled up because clearly she's not tagging her in none of these tweets. So like, did she just have Asian dolls page pulled up? 
Like, if she subscribed to Asian Dolls page and had her notifications turned on, and it just went zoop, zoop, zoop across her phone. Because how the hell was she seeing all her tweets? What is this, honey? Asian says, I had my ski mask on at the bowling alley. Five of y'all going to say, take that ish off and show that pretty face. We want to see that ish. Five of y'all says, what the F? What type of lie is that? I remember this. I remember. I so remember this. <laughs> I remember this. I remember this. You breathe life in her Miss Mamas. Hasn't had a moment since Obama was on office. Facts. I'm sending that hoe back to the dead. That's why she started an argument with me. She think that's going to get her hot. How did it start, though? I need to see the allegations of her touching her sibling and you abusing kids. LMAO, I need to see the proof of these allegations. Right. Until then, bitches just on Twitter talking. Right. Like, y'all can't just be accusing people of stuff like this. Now, I would go as hard for all of this right here. Like I do with the whole ET and Roly thing, but it's not the same. It's not the same. These are still very serious allegations, but we ain't never necessarily got to see Asian Doll or Stunner Girl a day in our lives again, unless you decide to bring them back. But it's different with Roly and ET because Roly was accusing ET of doing something that was harmful to the company. So it's a little bit different. Even though all of these allegations are still OD. Um, every label is calling my phone right now and wants to sign me so I can get you signed. You saying anything out of that brick shaped A of yours, you're a pedophile and you're into incest. Who touches their own siblings? All your friends said you used to want to play house and munch on their pussies. That's why you act like a little boy to this day. Oh. Well, I know what I'm titling this video. Ooh, ain't nothing wrong with a little munching on the homegirls. This is Twitter. They, they like that kind of kinky shit. <laughs> Somebody said, not with your siblings. What future say? If Metro don't trust you, I'm a shoe. <laughs> oh, oh, that's why they named their album that. Oh. We don't trust you, and we still don't trust you. I get it. Okay. Okay. Oh, not me being late to the party. She was munching on her siblings. If you agree with that, you're literally disgusting. I mean, what age? Because that matters. Like, all little kids play house until you realize what the hell you're doing and realize how dumb it is. And you, you know what I'm saying? Like, that, like, come on now. Come on now. <clears throat> but if you like 18 and shit and but like straight on fucking that's that's completely different. That's completely different. Um, every label is calling my phone right now and wants to sign me. I can oh, I already read that. Crack the F up. For you to think I was talking about you was hella funny. Who are you? It's so many networks and bees going on TV who want to talk ish about me. Your career is so dead that you didn't even exist to me when I made this post. See, why did Asia start deleting her post? That's what I want to know. Not her stalking. She's trying to prove herself so bad. Like, you're not even one of the bees I have current beef with. I have my own network and other networks I'm into it with. Stunner, that's the problem. You are the problem. You got too much drama surrounding you, Stunner. It's, it's not cute. Meanwhile, my mom didn't even call me on my birthday. I mean, why would she if you was allegedly fucking her man, Asia? Both my parents still living a healthy, but not having a mom or daddy support a relationship is really effed up for me. I be having to teach myself ish. They should have. I'm glad I have balanced though, and I'm so overworked that I'm numb to not having a relationship with my parents. I mean, if you're fucking on your mother's nigga, Asian, come on now. What's going on? I bet she ain't called because you fucked her nigga. <laughs> Look, right. Ooh, this is T. City Girls was just headliners a few months ago for a show, and Asian Doll was an opener. And Baby Crowd did not know one song by her. Y'all hear the differences. Oh, <laughs> 
<coughs> her body is cute. Her body's cute, and I like her outfit. I mean, I guess. Um, okay, let's keep going. Anyways, back to the dead you go. I'm finna go to the go to my movie that didn't have movie time. And I got paid 500 k Up your rate, Spooky. Price. Put a price on that free oyster. And then JT posted this, which was messy. JT, now why would you post this in the middle of their beef? Why would you post this, JT, in the middle of their beef? Messy. Messy. Because why would you post this in the middle of their beef? So that's how JT, I guess, gets brought into it. Because then Stunner, of course, quotes this and says, I'm bringing sis out to one of my tour dates. Get y'all tickets. Ah, ah, ah. <sighs> okay, was there anything else? I'm finna make a show on my network where I call out the ops and challenge them to come catch a fate. If they don't show up, they pussy. I'll even let you bring your own security and all that. Stunner girl, shut up. Because Agent literally just said, Zeus got 100000 for us to fight. Shut up. Shut up. So, at the top of Stunner page, it says, I'm about to start beating and snatching you rat bees chains again. Why y'all acting like I ain't Reaper? Like the score ain't 3-0. You bees ain't dead ish, but rat battle, it's not a bee like me and all the history. I don't want y'all cheap stainless. I'ma just dead you every time. <sighs> Go like this video so we can get into Asian tweets. I don't even know what I played and what I didn't play. Okay. Um <sighs> Imagine me ducking a fade from Stunner Girl, even a blonde bee would win that. Um, Asian doll said she looked better than JT and Stunner Girl. Then here goes Santana. See, this is what people be talking about. Then he be fake confused, like he don't know what's going on, just big and messy. Yeah, all of them are messy. 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 All of them are messy because you know what you're doing. You know what you're doing. JT was messy and then uh, Saucy is messy for that. <laughs> JT said no shade because Asian are really my baby, but we don't make the same kind of music. We all in our own lanes. We all going to win. I love Asian Doll since Real B Anthem. Mind you, Asian doll is the reason why the city girls fell out with Meg. Clock it. Clock it. I've been saying that for years. 
So it's all just six degrees of separation and just messy. And just messy. What's Asian's um Asian the brat? Which one is hers? Is it this one? No. Uh, is it this one? No. <sighs> My God. Is it this one? Right. <sighs> my God, my God, my God, my God, my God today. Okay, so we just going to start it from here. Every girl needs them an NYC friend. Asian, you're not from NYC, though. You're not from New York. Okay, imagine every beef is crazy. I do not know these bees from a can of paint. I hate a bee that, that thinks she knows everybody's business. The last day of filming is today for ba uh, Baddies Caribbean. I came and I popped my ish. I thought I built real bonds with all the girls. I never in my life thought I'd do something like that. I'm so happy I did it. The experience was fun. Come on, 777. Everybody say, hey, spirit. Always and forever doing better. Bitches be jealous because I'm real life blessed. Y'all literally just be doing anything so these people can acknowledge y'all. I would watch this if Asian was on it. Girl, shut, shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Um... Whole bunch of retweets about how pretty she is. Okay, what else do you have to offer? I don't know you. No, I don't know you. I will beat the dog ish out of Stunner Girl, LMAO. B, you are a prostitute. You've been getting pimped out since birth. Suck my D and grieve your brother. Oh, I hate when ugly bees include they self and ish. Got nothing to do with them. <coughs> I could go for some chicken fingers. I really could. I really could. I could really go for some chicken fingers right now. And some hot wings. Like hot wings and chicken fingers and lemon pepper wings. Actually, I could just go for some wing stock. Really. Um, I will beat all you hoes up in real life. Not Asian are retweeting this. Um, bees will say anything when you on a ass. Who this of? Oh, okay. These pictures are cute, though. I wonder if they took it, like, with, like, a portable, like, light. It's cute. I mean, listen, she's very pretty. She's very, very pretty. And I want to like her so bad. So I'm going to give her a chance when the show starts. Because she might surprise me, and I'm hoping that she surprised me. Okay? If she surprised me, I will be the biggest Asian doll fan. What? Okay? I will, I will change my name to Scott Brat. Okay. I'm not beefing with none of these bees. Respectfully, I've called all, all these hoes out to fight. Nobody ever want to fight. I have no ops. All you hoes fans, and I don't know y'all. Any rat bee that got a problem with me, let's fight. I will literally beat hoes the F up, but nobody want to fight ever, though. But they quick to argue on social media. I mean, that's Stunner Girl's MO at this point. What's this? That's Cuban dog, best friend, and she let her get beat up. It's the fact that people are back and stunning the known colorist who's been making fun of Asian for being dark skinned for years and puts dark skinned women in cages like they're animals. I'm not here for the colorist conversation. I don't give a I don't care about none of that. I don't care about none of that. None of that. Dude, Asian bitch, that shit crazy how she trying to That's Cuban dog, best friend, and she let her get beat up and then do shit, bitch. 
fuck you talking about? She let that bitch get beat the fuck up. Bitch, it's been nine months since Rocky beat the bitch. Asian doll, Nani, Britney, Kayla, all them bitches ugly as fuck. Rocky, they ugly as hell. And they not going to end they off. You know the word I was about to say. <laughs> <laughs> black ass bitches. <laughs> bitch. A black bitch. My crush is a bitter black bitch, and that's because I'm like that bitch. She she every post the bitch was making was about her skin and shit. Again, I know with some people that's gonna be oh kind of kind of kind of okay. I don't entertain these conversations because at the end the I the 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 the. Self love, please. Self love, please. Self love. That's number one. And then number two, my mouth is deadly. My mouth is very deadly. You want to sit and complain about that? Oh, I know that it's triggering you. Oh, I'm going to say it. Like, so Asian doll wanted to make all of those colorist ass tweets and whatnot. Whether it's right or wrong, I see why Stunna said what she said about Asian Doll because she's referring to the colorist tweets that Asian put out. But again, miss me with the colorist come. I, I, this shit is low vibrational as it is. I, I, she's always hated black girls. That was her only comeback is go to black burnt bitch. That's why she's so mad. She hates seeing this black bitch winning. Asian, we literally just saw your past post. Is this not you, the pot calling the kettle black? Like, this is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about. I, t- I don't care about these conversations. I don't care because I, I just, I just don't care. I just don't care. I'm not dark, LOL, I'm brown, sir. I mean, she has a right to say that she's not dark and say that she's brown. She has a right to say that because I'll be seeing people on people do that with Real Housewives of Potomac. Like Candace is not dark skin; she's brown skin. But anyways, again, I I don't even I've been hearing and talking and seeing all of that on my timeline all week. I don't care about none of that. I don't care about none of that, especially not no tweets from eleven years ago. How do you feel now? How do you feel today? That's the conversation that needs to be had. So let's move on past that one. Um, Zeus just said they never paid a cast member five hundred k in life, especially not no. That they needed they plat that needed they platform and that's the oh I read that already. Let's go. Come on, I'm ready to wrap this video up. Stunner saw Asians post about how much she got paid on baddies and got triggered. Okay, so Stunner started the BS. Okay. I believe they're ganging up on her because they know she's about to be getting attention. I hate that she's acknowledging the bums. Okay. I really love Vaughn because no matter if you're a girl or boy, you could die about playing with him or his loved ones. Okay, Asia. Um, it's time to move on. Every time I do something big, these bees come out of nowhere hating on me, but oh my god. How are y'all entertained by shit like this? Anything else? Anything else of value? Okay, because I'm I'm only spending time on her page because we done spent five hours on stunners. So I'm trying, I'm like, I'm looking for something redeeming <laughs> at this point. Um That's how it always is. The internet really tried to tarnish Asian doll image. Made fun of this girl when she pretty as F and know how to rap. Leaked her OnlyFans. Meanwhile, she minded her business making money. Made fun. I mean, everybody OnlyFans get leaked. Let's not try to turn that into a social justice movement. Everybody, uh, LPSG.com. Literally, you can Google whoever OnlyFans you want to see. Type their name in. Type in OnlyFans and type in video. There will be a website. And more than likely, it's probably on LPSG.com. You're welcome. Um, is there anything redeeming up here for Asian doll? I like those dark skin, pretty girls with that curly hair. Oh no, okay. So now she's trying to okay. So um, if y'all care, if y'all care, don't get into my comments with the colorist conversation. I don't because I don't care. But if you care, I guess y'all can screenshot this or just take a moment to pause the video and read whatever she's saying here. Cause I guess now this is where she's coming back out years later to show that she actually does love dark skin. And okay. 
Um, when people argue with Asian and got to calling her ugly, that's how I know they ran out of it to say. B still stuck in 2014 chasing a hit. Got off baddies and career still in a dumpster. Everything you bees did, my bitch did better. You bees was not on red carpets. Bees was not a bad. The gag is, is that they both in the same exact spot. One just making more money. If your chain got snatched and you got stripped out your wig and all you did about was call the police, stop rapping. B, I love my skin. I've been told I was beautiful since birth with F. And I've always had why the F would I hate myself, B. I wasn't bullied in school about my skin complexion. B, as you saw, you used to call me black burnt bitch on your own, ho. Huh? You made them videos getting exposed, color is saggy. Ugh. This is why I don't care because is there not proof of both of them being colorist? And then a lot of the times y'all don't be wanting to have a real conversation about the real things that we say. In real life, but then like online, all of a sudden everybody a social justice warrior and got got 10 degrees and okay, 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 okay. The black community was built off ignorance. So until we start having them deep, deep, deeply rooted conversations, then I don't want to have a conversation about my actual roots growing out of my head. Like clock it. My point, nobody ever wanna fight. I'll go to war with all you hoes and when. Uh, uh, yeah, I don't like Asian and that's a pro. Okay. Every time I do something big, they come out of nowhere. Okay, I'm done. I'm done. They both annoying. They both annoying. Um, I thought JT had stepped in into this. If she had, okay, well, good for her. At this point, I don't care. I'm ready to move on to a different topic. Y'all let me know how y'all felt about all of this that in the third down in the comment box below. Um Anybody that try to bring up colorism and I don't care, Scott, I don't care. You're getting blocked. It's just that simple. I'm not about to over explain myself as to why I don't want to get into those deep conversations. This channel is meant about fun. And unless we're going to have the real, real conversations, I don't want to have it at all. It's that simple. Okay. So try to be cute and creative if you want to, and that ass going to be blocked. Okay. Otherwise, y'all can let me know how y'all felt about all of this down in the comment box below as if I get fun. Okay, and you can um stream my music as if you give up. Okay, go to my website. Oh, you can't. It's <laughs> the website's not on. But if you want to book a read in, it's fifty percent off. DM me on Instagram. If you just want to hit the cash app to hit the cash app, that's totally fine too. Okay, um, that's it. I'm ready to move on to the next topic. Bye, girl. Universal bad bitch, everybody language, everybody know she the mud, mud, bad, bad. Universal bad bitch, everybody language, everybody know she the mud, mud, bad, bad. Universal bad bitch, everybody language, everybody know she the mud, mud, bad, bad. Universal bad bitch, everybody language, everybody know she the mud, mud, bad, bad. Fuck it up, love it how they cutting up. Now these niggas showing up, but wasn't when I'm coming up. Fuck it up, love it how they cutting up. Now